Dear friends, in this video, we are going to discuss how to dynamically render components in React. That means, I need to render React components dynamically during runtime based on the props state root changes. I will explain my code with you. I imported React from React. Then I define my components. Home, About, Contact. These are three components. Then I did component mapping. I declared a components object. Home, Home, About, About, Contact, Contact. In my app component, I have a constant variable component name. Initially, it is about. This could come from prop state or root. That means on runtime, this component name can be anything. Initially, it is about. It can be reassigned with other values like home, contact, based on props, state or route changes. Then dynamically choose the component from the mapping. So const dynamic component is equal to components of component name. Once we got the component name here, based on this component mapping, we will get the exact name. Components of component name. In this case, components of about, which is this about. So, our dynamic component is about now. This dynamic component have the value about. Now, in the return statement, after h1 tag, if dynamic component exists, we will show that component. Otherwise, component not found. We are using ternary operator here. Then we have export default output. Here I declared a constant variable with about. It can be let and can be reassigned on runtime based on your props. If you have props here or if you have state. Something like a route, something like a page, set to page like that based on these things based on props state or route you can re assign component name automatically at this line it will assign in the dynamic component and this will be executed based on this value we will render corresponding component here that means uh, initially it should be about that means about component will print there about component will show on the screen so this code you can be modified and used in your project i hope this video is helpful for you thank you